Our last day at Disney was a park hopping day, which started at Magic Kingdom just to take one more ride on Buzz Lightyear because it's the best. Guys, my family does not joke around at Buzz Lightyear. It is serious. We went to MGM next, which had some cool Monsters University displays outside the entrance. And the buildings at MGM had some cool facades, but there really wasn't much to see or do that we were really interested in. Although I do wonder if John Green knew that Dick Clark said best wishes as well. We hopped on over to Animal Kingdom next, which had some beautiful scenery, and I remembered visiting the Tree of Life when I was very, very little. We watched one parade, but it was pretty dull. Personally, I think the only thing that made Animal Kingdom worth the trip was the safari ride. Getting the fast pass for the safari was absolutely worth it because the lines would get ridiculously long throughout the day. It was really, really cool to see these animals so close to our little truck, and the guides spoke a lot about how they try very hard to recreate the environment that the animals come from with specific plants and trees and so on. Our truck had to stop for a good 10 minutes at one point to wait for some rhinoceroses or rhinoceri to get out of the way. After Animal Kingdom, we drove to Cape Canaveral and saw some cruises waiting to leave. Our destination was Cocoa Beach. Being from landlocked Oklahoma, the beach is always a novelty for me, so anytime I'm within driving distance of the ocean, I have to go. This was definitely one of my favorite days of the trip because it was really relaxing and nice to take a break from walking around and waiting in lines. I could spend days laying on a beach. We stopped at this ginormous Ron John surf shop on the way out of town, and the next day we drove home. We passed a huge, dangerous wreck and saw the traffic backed up for miles. There was a helicopter and people were sitting outside of their cars on the side of the road or in the grass. And then we got to see one more beautiful Florida sunset and that was it for our 2013 summer vacation. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you want to go watch from the beginning, you can click here. Happy vacationing!